Romero de la Cruz coming to you live from Rancho Buena Vista High School, the site of tonight's LCFL Game of the Week action, Week 8 here to be exact. It's going to be the National City Bears who come in at 6-1, and one, taking on the North County Cobras and what should be a game to talk about for the ages. This game here is going to feature two of the top defenses as well as two of the top offenses in the entire LCFL. Quarterback Jerry Garrett from North County Cobras comes in having himself an MVP type of season, over 1,000 yards passing on the year, while Michael Clark just last year for the National, or last week for the National City Bears surpassed the 1,000-yard the mark as well. The National City Bears, they come in with the number one defense and the number one offense in the entire LCFL. They're going to look to put a stamp on where they stand here in the LCFL here in Week 8. Talking to Coach Vincent for the Cobras before the game, he said they need to get to the quarterback, they need to cause some turnovers, and they need to execute when they do get those turnovers here. David Rainey on the other side, the defensive captain, the defensive leader for the National City Bears, he says he wants a chance to make those big returns. He wants an opportunity to help his defense out and become a factor here today. Keys for tonight for the National City Bears is going to be get that ground game going early and set up the pass off of that. Defensively, we know what they like to do. They like to rush three, get to the quarterback. So the keys for the North County Cobras is going to get protection for Jerry Garrett here today. If he gets that protection, it's going to be a long day for the secondary of the National City Bears. But we have a great game on tap here, which should start in the next 15 minutes. National City Bears, North County Cobras coming up in just a few. We're joined now by head coach of the National City Bears, Coach Winston. Coach Winston, you guys come in at 6-1. and one, and that North County Cobras coming in at 4-2. and two, two of the top teams in the LCFL. How big is this game for you guys today? Well, tonight, uh, the game is real big for us tonight, basically, and I'm pretty sure it's big for them also as well because it'll show who will get the second seed uh, seeding in the next, for the playoffs. And it's also big for us, for us to be coming up to be a first-year organization and to be able to come against the national champs from uh, the year before and the LCFL champs of the same year. It's big for us in that occasion to let us know that we are the new kids on the block and we are an up-and-coming team. Coach, their, their team defensively that likes to sit sit back they don't send many guys four guys um, what is the game plan here offensively for you guys who last week we saw we saw a little bit of Romero Crawford at the running back one play we didn't see him after the game what's the status on him for tonight uh, well Romero Crawford you know he comes in he's a good uh, one-two punch with Kevin Traveler you know we try to come in we pound the ball a little bit with Kevin Traveler then we try to change up the pace with Romero but uh, coming into tonight's game, uh, we know that they sit back a little bit, and we're going to try to take our shots, o shots over top. And, you know, we just go from there and see what happens. Coach, offensively, you guys got uh, Michael Clark leading the way for you guys with the quarterback, and you guys have one of the deepest uh, threats when it comes to wide receivers. But let's look at the flip side. We talked about the, the offense. Let's talk a little bit about your guys' defense. You guys sent three. How are you guys able to get to the quarterback with just the, the, your, your defensive front? Well, I continue to always tell the guys that you have to find ways to uh, apply pressure to these football teams. You know, we run a three front. Everybody knows we run a three, three stack. And what we do, we try to blitz from different angles. You don't know which way we're going to come with our blitzes. But I always tell our guys, if we can get pressure with our front three, which we do normally each game, that w we can be successful with these games. All right, thanks, Coach. Are you here from Coach Winston of the National City Bears? They come in at 6-1 and one here. We're a couple of minutes away from kickoff. Thanks, Coach, and good luck out there tonight. Appreciate it.